Good evening, I'm Robert Penguinson, political correspondent. I'm here live from Bowden and welcome to the special 2022 May of Bowden broadcast of SCN. Today, I'm here with the new mayor of Bowdoin, Jan Nowak. Hello, Jan. Hello. So, as a new mayor of Bowdoin, how do you feel about having power to a whole town? Well, Robert, that's a good question. Well, I feel great and determined that I can change the town into a better place and make the best town in separate. We will overtake fairly by satisfaction at some point, trust me. You are the lowest by satisfaction. It does not matter. All right, then. So, if you are going to overtake Bellary, what are you going to change? The atmosphere here. Don't get me wrong, but I love this. I love this town, but wait. What was that? What is up all this? It's coming! Camera one's not working. Thank you. Face the camera three. Just take this piece of paper and read it out. Okay then, um. Uh. Should I start? We're already live. Oh. Uh, uh, uh alright, so. All right, sorry to interrupt this broadcast, but we are receiving some breaking news. Let me just put this paper up. Uh, apparently, we are picking up reports... Uh, we are picking up reports that there has been a meteor crashing straight to the center of Bowdoin just a few moments ago. As a result, the entire town of Bowdoin has been in ruins with the train station being completely gone, blocking the railway from going anywhere. There has been some damage to Stepford City, mostly in the east. All of this damage costs trillions of pounds. Initial estimates put the death toll into... Oh no. 100,000 people and 300,000 injured. We are currently experiencing some power failures, so apologies if you are having issues watching this program at home. In just a moment, Jay Stepper will be reporting live from Stafford Central, talking about the fire that has caused in the main station. James? Yes, uh, this is James from Stepford, reporting from Stepford Central, indeed. As you can see in the background, there is a fire going around. I'm being told the reason why is because of the blast. Since it, was, since it was powerful, the electricity wires started a fire, and not everyone is currently evacuated from the station. There has only been three people seriously injured, but there are no fatalities. Right, so, oh my god, there's a train derailed! Cameron, show it to the audience! We don't know what's going on about their fatalities or injuries here, but there has been some ambulances and fire trucks around the station. We are going to interview this old person right here. Excuse me? Yes, young man. What do you think about this situation? What situation? Station's on fire! <laughs> oh yeah. Well, I want to see my son Nathan from Bowdoin. Unfortunately, the station told us to evacuate, and I did. One nice lady helped me to evacuate the station. Well, uh, sorry to hear that. Um, have a nice day. You too, love. Well, uh, that's all for Stepford Central. Back to you, Pengu. Yes, we're going back to Pengu from the studio now. I can't deal with this anymore. It's such a huge nightmare. Please calm down. I can't calm down. My brother is dead. I was about to die from that freaking fire. Pengu, we're already live. Uh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh. Um, I, I, I'm so sorry about that. Um, we just had to evacuate the building because of a fire. After this, we may have to strike the channel for a couple of days. Anyway, uh, sh sh should I do it? Please do. Okay, then. I, I, uh, I, I really don't talk about my personal life and my job. It's not relevant or important. Um, the rumors are true. I do have a brother. His name is Robert. And I, right now, I, I just can't believe what happened to him in my own eyes. You saw him in the beginning of the program. Talking to a mayor. And I, 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 I don't think he's alive right now. And I should imagine that there's many of you at home digesting this, this news tonight. And you also have your loved ones 
in Belgium. So when I tell you, I know how you're feeling. I really mean that. Life is just a huge roller coaster recently. Our county may be bankrupt with billions from this. We can all agree. But it's not over. We'll find out the future together. I will be here every night reporting the news, feeling the same way as you are right now. My name is Pingu Penguinson. If you can, have a peaceful night.